Hey guys, so we are here for our, or not our, but we're here for Miss Addie's two week update. Okay, so as I said, she is two weeks old to, well, she's 15 days old today. She we went to the doctor yesterday and everything is a-okay. So I have a list of everything that needs to be said and then... There is a few videos that I want to do, a few videos that will be inserted throughout the video for a reference, or not for reference, but for memory wise. Does that make sense? Sorry, I'm looking at this. Okay, so one thing that she has started to do this week is comfort nurse and uh, slash cluster feeding. Um, she does a little bit of both and I mean, I'm okay with it. It's just a lot of um, laying around doing nothing. <laughs> Um, she would rather be naked than have clothes on and that's mainly at night because she likes to be right up against you and burn your skin off because she's a furnace but she'd rather be naked and covered and naked and swaddled in a blanket or naked right up against you and covered with a blanket and one big thing is she loves the sun if there was like four days where there was no sun outside and it was just rainy and cloudy and she was mad like she, her face was just so upset and she loves looking at the sun she like i don't know so much it's not really warm outside so she can't really feel the warmth of the sun but she likes the sun like peeking through the windows and stuff like that i'm pretty sure it's the light <laughs> um co-sleeping has been great especially since i can move around a lot more like when she wants to be when she needs to be fed on one side and not the other i don't have to like get up out of bed i can actually just roll over put like a little pillow barrier so her brother or her dad doesn't roll over on top of her her umbilical cord fell off on sunday which made her 12 days old when she lost her umbilical cord it was like sunday morning and i was changing her diaper and i was like <laughs> She doesn't have her umbilical cord. What do I do? Where did it go? Because I kept Declan's umbilical cord. So I wanted to keep her umbilical cord. I found it. It was intertwined in her blanket. So I found it and I kept it. <laughs> her first bath was on Sunday and she absolutely loved it. I did get videos and pictures of it. So I'll go ahead and insert that here. Oh. <sighs> she did an amazing job she she started to fall asleep during it she was very just comfortable in it she was just comfortable in the bath and fell asleep and was laughing and giggling that's also another thing um she smiles and i know a lot of people say it's gas like we can tell her gas smiles but she looks at her daddy and she just smiles it up and it's like um, she looks at her brother and she smiles and she doesn't smile at the cat. She does not like the cat for some reason, but she smiles and uh, she just gets super happy and I mean, I believe she's really smiling just because it's it's not like where she's like half asleep and she's like, no, she like really smiles and it's really cute. Yesterday we found out she is seven pounds, six ounces, 
which makes it where she has gained nine ounces since birth. She's also 20 and a half inches long, which she was 19 and three fourths. So she has gained, or she has grew three fourths of an inch. We, there's something that I have always said no to is pacifiers. And with the comfort nursing, it's like, I just need like two seconds to myself. And so we got pacifiers and she will not take them. She refuses to take them and which doesn't shock me because that was the same way her brother was. And I mean, I'm fine with it. I'll have to deal with it. But it was just like, I wanted that one thing. We call her a high altitude baby because she wants to be held, but she doesn't want to just be held. She wants to be held and like up. Like she wants you walking around, standing, moving, doing things. Oh, she's constantly getting the hiccups. Her next appointment is when she is one month old slash four weeks old because it's on the 20th and she's will be a month old on the 22nd i don't know why my brain like spaced out there um she's still in newborn diapers and newborn clothes and she is in preemie socks oh she's a super gassy baby i always like she'll be in her swing and you'll hear you'll hear her fart and then you're like oh she's gonna take off anytime soon She's a really sweet baby. Um, she does wake up in the middle of the night. Um, it's mainly to eat um, and then comfort nurse. Um, she's not really a too fussy baby, except when she's hungry. Um, she loves her bubby. She'll listen to bubby stories for, she'll listen to bubby stories forever. And Anything you want to say? Nothing? Her little hands. So yeah, I'm now I'm going to insert the footage of her um, two week appointment video. Um, there We did like a little vlog and I never finished it off so I'm just going to add it into this because it's just us mainly at the doctor. Mm -hmm. Baby girl. I put a wipe on you. Lord have mercy. Well, that's what you wanted daddy's eyes, huh? Okay, Nikki, Nikki. He doesn't have to have a doctor's appointment today. Where are you gonna go? So she's 20 and a half. 20. She grew a quarter of an inch. So 20 and a half. Oh, she did? Oh. 20 and a half, and then six. The net. Seven, six. Woohoo! has very good head control um i have a picture of it but i do not have any video of her head control so yeah hopefully next week she'll actually be awake for her 
three week up wait well no i'll probably just do her four week update because um we'll have more information then so i'll say bye we'll see you in our next video and i hope you enjoy bye. the next few clips bye tell us how those feel not good say hi i'm maddie She is constantly getting the hiccups with your little feces. Oh, big yawn. Ooh. Oh. Okay.